<laughs> okay, anyway, um, unrelated to food, we're going into energy now. Yeah. And we have the LNX conference and convention uh, to talk about. So let's uh, make this very special phone call out to the person behind it all. Good morning, Mr. Allen. How are you? Hi, good morning. I'm fine. How are you? Uh, we're doing good. Tell us a bit about the convention and conference. Okay, we uh, are the organizers of ASEAN LNX, which will open on the 20th of March at KLCC. Mm -hmm. um, as you alluded just now, it's uh, an event um, focusing on the energy needs of Malaysia. Mm -hmm. So it will cover conventional, traditional energy needs and also the renewable energy that's now becoming a lot more uh, um, part of the energy mix of Malaysia. Mm -hmm. And we're working with uh, TMB, they're the hosts for the exhibition. Uh, Malaysia's utility and right. it's also run alongside uh, industrial automation which is a mm -hmm. show which focuses on automated solutions for manufacturing so that, that's um, I guess the overall summary of what we're doing next this week. Uh, Alan uh, maybe you can help us understand why is Malaysia the focal point for energy in ASEAN? Well it's not so much the focal point for ASEAN we but our title we try to reflect uh, the visitor analysis of Asian LNX. So we're getting now a lot of visitors from outside Malaysia, uh, from the ASEAN region. Mm -hmm. So although the show um, does focus primarily on Malaysia's energy needs, we're now seeing a trend where we're getting more and more visitors from Indonesia, Thailand, the Philippines, Singapore. Mm -hmm. So we feel that the title of the show should reflect that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, well, this is not the first time you've had it. Uh, share with us your experience from last year's uh, event. Well, this show, uh, as you said, has been running for a number of editions now. And uh, what we're seeing um, is certainly increased uh, interest from international technology suppliers. We have a big German uh, presentation uh, this year's show. Also from Singapore, China. So the international exhibitor side of the show is increasing. Um, Malaysia's uh, energy uh, mix, if you like, is changing slightly, and you'll see that our show reflects that evolution. Uh, a lot more um, uh, emphasis now, if you like, on energy efficiency, uh, the renewable energy. So those things are beginning to uh, get much more priority. Um, but our exhibitions are very simple. We provide a platform for buyers to have a seat. Of course, I've got another question for you, Mr. Aylin. Um, um, what's your take on this event and uh, how will this event run? What's your, you know, um, maybe some experience that you could share with our viewers? What will they expect uh, when they are there? Well, I think um, what you will see primarily this year is companies trying to provide, provide a solution for energy efficiency. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about um, low emission light bulbs, talking about uh, intelligent street lighting, um, more efficient air conditioning systems, anything that, that, that will save the end user mm -hmm. in terms of energy consumption. Um, renewable energy is a bit more long term, mm -hmm. We're seeing a lot more interest now in solar energy and biomass, I think those are the two most uh, prevalent uh, forms of alternative energy sources in Malaysia, so it, it's, it's in tandem. Um, and obviously the, the technology uh, that you'll see on the show here will reflect that. Uh, we also have a conference which is focusing on uh, asset management okay. in a smart grid context. So TMB now is, is looking to try and tap uh, areas that need peak power, take them from areas that need less power. So it, it's, uh, it's smart energy management and that will be happening alongside the exhibition. Also we have a business to business matching uh, session which in the old days, it was enough for organizers to provide a platform for buyers and sellers to meet, but now we have to do a bit more. So we're, we have a B2B matching session whereby we try and match before the show mm -hmm. visitors to exhibitors. So that, that's a bit of uh, extra dating, if you like, that we're trying to do this year. All right. So, uh, Ellen, on that note, we are short on time. Just uh, share with us the dates and venue for this event before well, we say the goodbye. The show will kick off on the 20th of March. Mm -hmm. at Kuala Lumpur Convention Centre at 10 a.m. in the morning. Mm -hmm. um, we will run from Wednesday to Saturday, so we'll right. conclude at 5 p.m. on the 23rd of March. All right. Thank, Thank you so much, Alan, for being here on the show. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Mm -hmm.
And good news for consumers out there, energy prices, especially for renewable energy, is coming down. And you know, you might see your own personalized solar system uh, coming your way anytime soon because in Europe the prices are now one tenth of what they used to be 10 years ago. Wow. So that's a big change coming your way.